Welcome back to another unpacking. This coin I bought at a Facebook group. Let's see. Okay. Yeah. So another gold coin. But I'm not so fan of this gold coin. This, let's see, five kronor. And let's see what country it's from. Focus. Nope. There you go. From Sweden, Sveriges. Konung. I'm not so fan of the Swedish gold or silver. Not at all. That's our neighbor country. And there is a nice people. But there's a yeah the people they don't understand so much if you understand what I'm talking about. Uh, it's a joke. Uh, the, the Swedish people, they understand what I'm talking about. So they made lots of gold and silver in the 80s, 1800 and beginning of the 1900. This is from 1920. It's a very ordinary gold coin. You can buy it to gold price. I got this $20 under gold spot on a Facebook group. So I was very satisfied with it. But I have, if I want to sell it, I have a big problem. To sell this, uh, even twenty percent under spots, it's very very difficult to sell Swedish uh, gold and silver coins here. It's not the most popular coin in the world. So if you see uh, Swedish. Silver or gold, buy it, buy it, buy it way under gold just because it's Swedish. Uh, yeah. If you can say, yeah, the coins from Sweden, they are cursed. Uh, yeah, yeah, I can't say, yeah. It's true. And I have lots of Swedish gold coins and silver coins. I'm not happy about it, but you can say gold is gold and silver is silver and it's money. Yes, it is, but it's Swedish. They have made the gold and silver. It's not the same. You can buy, buy everything else from around the world, gold, silver, ordinary coins, whatever. But when you can come to Swedish coins, it's not the best. It's not. Therefore, I always buy silver and gold from Sweden under a spot. Never over, never ever do that. <laughs> and this, this, uh, the Swedish people, they understand what I'm talking about. So, and they are very nice people. They are. So, no ugly words against the Swedish people.
they are very nice people. But there is something, something, uh, uh, if you can say curse, I'm not sure, but yeah, I can take, I can try to take it up to see. So you can see. So if you have talked to a Swedish people, you understand what I'm talking about. It's a beautiful coin. It is, and it's gold. Very shiny. Five kronor. And here you go. And there is also the Swedish king. I have a history. Um, in the 1980s, I worked with a man, a Norwegian man. But his mother was thrown out of Sweden. And I asked why? This king, yeah, he was the father of the old man I talked to. The mother and the child, uh, the boy was thrown out from Sweden because he was, she was pregnant with the Swedish. King, the housemate, and in that time, Norway and Sweden was, in fact, almost the same country. Not the same, but we have the same king. It's difficult, but yeah. So he made a girl pregnant and was shipped to another country, to Norway. And I worked with him. He was over 80 years old in 1980. And this coin is from 1920. So you can, yeah. He was the father. He's, he said so. If it's true, maybe I believed him because his mother was Swedish and she couldn't move back. It's not allowed for her. And in the paper, the father is him. But that was also some history and some gold. And thank you for watching.